You're now tuned in to Thoughts of a Black Sheep. And guess what? I got some thoughts. All right. I guess you're here to, to hear about these spells if you've seen the title. Uh, let's talk about some. Now, these spells that I uh I I talk about and I expose it's it's spells that is is letter letter spells is is word spells is word magic what they'll call it uh and its intent is to tell you something but not tell you something but at the same time tell you something now, I hope you can grasp what I just said, because these spells, that's what they do. These these phrases, these words that you see, it works on you from what I found out at least up to three ways. You know, they got a, the the I don't I can't tell you all how I interpret it. I have to use these words that the world put definitions with. Um, First, you got the. I guess the conscious, I guess the conscious person. Then you have, man, I got this bug. Then you have, you know, you got the spirit. Then you got that subconscious one. It's like you got three. It's three different yous, really. And you want to make them all one, but that's another subject. But I got my own phrases and, and names for this stuff to help me understand, but you know maybe i'll share that with y'all one day maybe i won't but anyway so you got the spells that that when 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 you see them if you don't consciously pick it up then it'll go well i, I said that backwards earlier it'll go to the subconscious first after it passed yo yo conscious like if you see something and you don't really I mean you see it but you like you see some numbers and you look at them and they just numbers well your subconscious them picked up what you didn't catch so now your subconscious all it's finna do is process it the best way it know how and the way it it know how to process it is the way that it it got it so if it's seen uh a spell let's say a, a word Oh, I give you a good one. If if, if it see the word uh, pill, okay, you didn't. You just seen pill. You seen letters P I L L. That's all you seen, right? So you, that's it. Pill, bam. That's just a word. You at the doctor, maybe you at the at the doctor, and they say something. You know, write you something. And you see, you look at the word pill. Now, when you look at that word pill, you reading and you see pill, your mind process. Not all words aren't aren't spell spells. Some words are there to connect the spells and some words are there. They they really they serve purposes other in other ways. Uh, but you looking at the word pill. Now. You see that word, but you didn't catch it consciously. You didn't really see what you're supposed to see. Like I said earlier, and its intent is to tell you something, but not tell you something, but at the same time, tell you something. Anyway, you got your subconscious to jump in, right? Subconscious say, dang, that's say ill. Because your subconscious pick up on on the things that you don't pick up consciously, and because if you could pick it up consciously, what'll happen is, you you can you can do what you want to do with it. You can use that power that you just you just grasp because you 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 um, consciously knowing what's going on. So it's like a tool. It's like you in a game or something. You walking around and you getting. You getting little trinkets, little knickknack things to help you when you um square up against the, against the enemy. You can use this stuff. That's what it's like. But your subconscious pick it up, and since you don't didn't consciously catch what the what the subconscious caught, y'all not together. So the subconscious be like ill. Nah, 
in the sub the subconscious go and um process things that's in in the conscience in in your in your memory all this stuff to see um what is ill what does ill mean uh and so it go through it through your mind and you already have been programmed to understand what ill mean well not understand it but they wrote this this these uh letters together i l l and said this is called ill and this is what it means the like some people whoever i don't know if they was people but they came together and they did this they came together and made words and it said this is what this is gonna mean okay once they agreed they however they put it in their books they put it in their books and they taught people to think how they wanted them them to think this is how they wanted us to think about these letters that have been put together, these little magical symbols that have been put together and that we speak. Man, it is deep. But uh so uh, ill means sick. Ill ill is not nothing good. So now your subconscious goes into the process of doing what the word that you just just went over um went over it start creating that in your body when yo yo let me see how to say it without saying saying it like that your subconscious will make your body it it it'll start your body being sick and if you not if you not um mentally strong enough to or, or, or maybe I should say consciously strong enough to shake your your um your body back or do whatever it is that's necessary to to get everything back in order then that that one little thing you read can take you out but the majority of us our you know our conscious and our spirit is you know like they they pretty they pretty strong so uh, they that help your subconscious out whether you know it or not. But anyway, so, but then, let me go back to the doctor. So the doctor after after they write your prescription and you you're gonna see, you know, they, are they gonna tell you or are they gonna they gonna write it down and let you know to go get these pills? I'm gonna write you this prescription for such and such. Or now they'll tell you the name and you got to look at the name of these things now like it's too obvious with with uh with the names of these these drugs and stuff that they they prescribe like i'm telling you if you want to learn the spells go look at listen at these names that they named these drugs and go look at the the words go look at the letters look how they put them together just man look at them backwards just look at the spells they right there in y'all face I'm telling you, they got spells out there that were actually like, well, I said spells. They got pills out there that were actually, actually put, will place spirits in you. I'm telling you, they, it's all in the names. And well, that's what they, what it is anyway. Any kind of, um, the pills and stuff that you take is, is, is like you putting you, they, they, should I say this? I'm going to just say this. They just put put things entities in these mixtures just like lady gaga what she did with her stuff before the people who's saying that that i'm crazy or that's not true that's weird or whatever lady gaga just did it and gaga do mean crazy but she just did it well not just did it but she did it y'all know she put her essence in however she did blood semen or whatever but she ain't the first uh celebrity to do that either she's not but this is what they do. So when you swallow those pills that have ill in it, well, then I'm telling you what it is. But look, they send you to the pharmacy. OK, if you're not conscious enough to understand when you look at that word pharmacy, like it right right there, it's a harm. H-A-R-M right there. It's all together. Pharmacy. And many of y'all have never seen that. It's because I don't know why. You know, sometimes you got to be real curious and want to figure stuff out. Most people, they just they just go going along with whatever. And and you could you could tell and you'd be like, man, they they going straight to the slaughter. They don't even know. But it is it, it just go like that, man. But after the doctor write the write the death, the death prescription, 
they send you straight to the um to the place to go get it and right in the place it tells you harm it's like it's like a warning sign like like i don't know how to explain it like that's the good side even though it's um you know they created this word but they have to tell you what's going on now and they do it they do it in secret they do it like jokingly they do it all kind of ways but it's like it's almost like um whenever they have to answer for what they have to answer for they can say well i told them we told them they just wasn't they wasn't smart enough to listen they they didn't pay attention they was too busy looking at this look they're gonna put all the blame back on you so they'll get sky get away sky free with their evil they i done seen it happen too many times i'm telling you but anyway so they send you right down to the pharmacy and they have harm right in there okay so now these spells come in all kind of other forms i, I don't know how long this is gonna be but if you still here i'm telling you finna that i'm just con oh I, I just looked at what something else i wrote down we got the grim reaper called bill gates why he have ill in his name why is a bill over like come on man y'all think this this um a coincidence you know you got ill right there then you got gates then you if you drop the the uh g it'll say eight it i'm telling you, you just go on and on you can do all kind of stuff with gates and you'll see everything about this dude name letting you know this is the grim reaper i'm telling you but you got ill right there and is it a coincidence that he's the one in charge of <laughs> of Killing everybody with vaccines? I don't think that's a coincidence. Bill Gates. Then we had a Bill Clinton. And look look how he hurt every um a whole bunch of so-called black men. Man, y'all don't man, I hope y'all get it. Let's 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 get a little more weird. If you still here, now this finna get it's it's weird to some people, but if you just follow what I'm saying. It's not hard. It's like you have to break the spell. Most just listen. All right, I wrote down black. I hope I done said that enough about black. That that's that's a a curse word. Be lack. I hope y'all get that by now. Now I want to get into these numbers because this number magic also. And I don't know how how I how I figured all this stuff out. I just listened to myself, and myself said do something, and I did it. I, I trusted the voice because it didn't sound like it was leading me wrong. But anyway, I heard loud and clear to, to add up the word God and add up the word Satan. Now, if I was to walk up to somebody on the street and just say that, hey, add up the word God and add up the word Satan. They wouldn't know what the they wouldn't know what the hell I'm talking about. They like, man, what? It'll confuse you and it sound confusing. But for some reason, when I heard when I heard that in inside myself, I knew exactly what it what I was supposed to do. I knew what I was supposed to do. So I went, got got me a piece of paper, well a tablet. I always had a tablet because I write a lot. I had a tablet, got my pen. And I added up the word God first. So how do you add up the word God? You go each letter. Each letter is a um is a number. And it's it's the alphabet. A through Z. That's 26 letters. So come on, man. One is A, two is B. Come on. I know we can do this. <laughs> so I added up the word God. So I did seven. Plus 15 plus 4. Now that's e, like 7. It's G. That's the seventh letter of the alphabet. Everybody know that. They taught they taught you a little bit, but they ain't give you everything. Then you got O, which is 15. And uh the D, which is 4. A, B, C, D. 4. See what I'm saying? You add, it's just like you you they taught you how to add. When they um, you know, you add it up. 7 plus 15 plus 4. It's gonna give you 26. Then you add up the word. I, no, I added up the word Satan. 
Now you do it the same process, but it's just gonna be different numbers, and it's gonna give you a different number. It's so it'll be nineteen plus one, plus twenty, plus one, plus fourteen. You add that up, it should give you fifty-five. So I was looking at, I was like, dang, twenty-six and fifty-five. I'm like, you know, it was it was interesting because I added up the word God and say twenty-six. Now twenty-six, that's the letter Z. That's the N right there. That's it. And then, you know, I, I did Satan. I said 55. Then I put the letters. It was an E and an E. And I, you know, I just didn't get it. I didn't. I was like, dang, man, this stuff crazy, though. So what I did, I took it a step further and I said, OK, let me do this. I added up the word wicked. OK, so and it was hard at first, like like this one. I was first doing it. So it was man, my mind was doing all kind of stuff. It had to get trained in this. So I added up the word wicked 23 plus 9 plus 3 plus 11 plus 5 plus 4 i added that up just to see what i get i got 55 i was like god dang hold up you mean to tell me you mean to tell me that they taught us you know i heard about satan and they say he wicked and now when i add when i add up satan it say 55 and i add up the word wicked it say 55 so that's connected they got a relationship so you put that you put that together and i'm telling you once once i did that that was it that was it it was just like um i don't know man my eyes just opened then i went i, I wanted to see lie because i always heard that that satan you know he, he was the, the father of lies he a liar so i did the word lie l-i-e now 12 plus 9 plus 5 and i got 26 i said oh man wait a minute now i couldn't deny it i'm like okay i just did satan and i did wicked and that was connected that was the same and, and you know it, it went together and i did god and i did lie and it's 26 i man i can't just just not look at this no more i'm like oh man and from that I went on and this all this have to do with with uh, with spells, with with word magic. They be using on us. They use it against us. And but I started connecting dots. I just I'm telling you and all man, all words, all of them go with <laughs> with certain numbers. And then if you if you just look at the words and man, it's so amazing. You will figure out a whole bunch of stuff that a lot of people still trying to figure out. But is the way I figured it out is like, man, I can't like it's hard for people to understand this stuff. But anyway, let me say this. I even went a step further because now I'm interested. And, and, and the reason I kept doing these deities, these Christian deities, because that's how I was raised. My uh, my dad, he chose to be a pastor, you know, when he was younger. And really, I was forced to doing what he he was doing i had to i had to learn what he learned because i was i was a child and i had to go i had to go to church all the time i'm telling you i was sick of church man i boy i talk about that another time but but i was just in church and i learned a lot i started reading revelation that would kept me interested in church so that, that's why i kept just going to these deities and stuff this church stuff because i already had them figured it out that is a lot of a lot of stuff that's 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 real real fishy and wrong with that whole religion, and so I just started doing little little word things and I was figuring it out. But then I I got to the thing when I added up the word Jesus, so I added up the word Jesus, it equals seventy four. Okay, so after I did that, I went to Lucifer. Man, why? lucifer equals 74 i'm like man come on now come on now this 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 can't be happening here but and i, I always remember hearing people say that i'm talking about way back when i was younger they'll say that jesus and lucifer is is really the same person if you, you know just trying to tell you how to, how you really should read the bible and boy if you could ever really read the bible that's an interesting book for real and it tell you a really really different story than what you being taught and that's the thing if you being taught something 
Like if somebody teach you something, they teaching you a knowledge that they was taught. Like, but you have to always go back to the source and like, where did you get this knowledge from? What spirit driving, you know, feeding you this knowledge? Because that's how a lot of people get uh get caught up in all kind of scams, get caught up in all kind of uh foolishness. Because when these people talk with these spells that they use and they, they I'm telling you, everybody use spells when they talk. Everybody. I don't care if you Christian, I don't care if you uh, Muslim, whatever you is, everybody use spells. We talk. If you if you talk a language that was that was taught to you. Well, it, I don't know. I don't get it. It's weird because English, it just came natural to me because of where I'm from. I, but I still don't believe this was my language. This is not. It can't be because I ain't gonna get into that, but when I look at this, these, this, these words and letters and how they put together, man, this, I wouldn't come, I wouldn't talk like this, and I know getting well, none of my ancestors would come up with no wicked, um, no, no wicked spells and the stuff that they that that we speak, man. I'm telling you, we wouldn't, have, we wouldn't have did this. It, it takes something evil to come up with something like this, or maybe it's, it was good and they just made it evil. I don't know, but. But I added up Jesus and Lucifer and it both equals 74. Now, you can go even deeper with these numbers with that 74. I'm telling you because, man, I'm just giving y'all like a little basic blueprint. Like, I'm telling you, if you start doing it, which which most people ain't going to do it because they mind ain't going to ain't going to allow them to do it. Maybe because it's not for you. Maybe it's, 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 it's above your level of understanding and you just have to. You know, just maybe listen, you know, and wait if if it ever pop up in your life or something. I don't know. But some people brain going to just shut off and be like, man, I can't do this. It's too confusing. But to the ones that, that do get it and y'all y'all keep going with it. I'm telling you. Well, first of all, don't lose. Don't don't lose yourself, man. It's just all it is is letters and words. That's all it is. You know, it, it's it's triggers. That's all it is. You know, cause I say this. How long, man? How long I've been talking? Twenty three minutes. Dang, man! If anybody's still watching, I really appreciate. It. I'm gonna have to find a way to reward people for just just listening to me. That's weird, but anyway, twenty. Um, uh, I was gonna say twenty three minutes, but let me see. I'm gonna wrap it up. Yeah, I think I better wrap it up. I, I should say this. Should I say it? No, nah, I ain't going to say it. But this been Thoughts of a Black Sheep. You know what? I do need to say something else. Listen. Don't. This is what I was trying to say. Don't get caught up in these words. And, and if you keep looking at them and you see them in different places, don't get. Don't be afraid and. And. Uh let it affect you because i'm telling like i had to go through this when i when i was doing these these words i added up the word death you know and i seen the number that it is and when i tell you that number is everywhere when i tell you that number i don't want to say the number because i i don't want nobody to even really do it and not prepared because it will mess with you because when I started seeing the number, that number now had triggered had triggered this this uh the number triggered the word. And you know, the definition of that word, we know what that means. So I was starting to feel it. When I see it, I start to feel like, man, death coming. It's like it, I start boy, I can't I can explain it. I'm gonna explain it one day. But it was just so, so, man, I'm telling you, I had to really be strong. My spirit, my my subconscious and my and my consciousness all had to come together for one cause and one cause alone to not make this dude go crazy. I'm telling you, when I tell y'all this story, it's going to trip y'all out. But there's been thoughts of a black sheep. I'm out for real this time till the next video. I'm out.